everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. If you have no idea where I am right now, you probably didn't watch the new house tour. So I would suggest watching that first or just we're in the new house basically to make things simple. And today's video officially marks the very first renovation we are doing in this house. And it's probably not one that you're expecting. I mean, you probably know now from the title, but we are painting this 30 foot ceiling with clouds and I cannot wait. Okay, so this is a very tall ceiling. I actually don't know the exact height of the ceiling. I'll give you a little size comparison. I am five foot five inches and here I am next to the ceiling. So yeah, it's pretty tall. So you may be wondering, Mia, why are you painting clouds on your ceiling? Let me explain. So first of all, this ceiling may look white, but it's actually yellow. It's the same color as the walls. Like this is a little bit of a yellow wall and this is also the same. So initially I was like, okay, I'm gonna paint the ceilings white. And then I was like, well, I'm already up there and I'm already painting the ceiling. And I saw this picture on Pinterest and I was like, should we? And everybody I've told about this idea seems really excited about it. And I kind of want to live in a little storybook house. So I think this is the perfect thing to do here. I feel like it will boost my happiness. My positivity will be up. My optimism will be up simply because when I look up, I'm going to see like cartoon clouds and this should just be an indicator of the crazy renovations we're gonna have coming, you guys. I'm not holding back. I was in an all painted white studio for too long. I'm ready to have a crazy color explosion. So yeah, today we are going to be painting this 30 foot ceiling with clouds and we have this huge scaffold to help us, which putting this together was so dangerous. I'm actually so surprised that they just allow anybody to rent a scaffold. All you gotta do is like sign your life away and you can rent this. And like we had to put it together. I'll show you a little bit of footage from it. It was scary. I just want everyone to say goodbye to my dad. He's setting up the scaffold and he is doing it in the most dangerous way all by himself. Won't wait for help. He signed his life away when he rented the scaffold and now he is literally giving up. No life insurance. Dad! I don't want to die today. Dad, if you fall, you're dead. The cloud ceiling is literally not worth it. Dad, see, this is what he's doing, you guys. Mom, look at your Dad, husband. Dad, Tate said not to do that by yourself. And you're wearing those riding shoes. And they're too big for him. Dad, are you crazy? Oh my gosh, you're like a monkey. Stop. Seriously, look. Let's show for a size comparison. My dad is eight feet tall. That is how tall it is. That's how tall it is next to an eight foot person. Anyways. Oh gosh. And yeah, we've literally only been living here like just over a week. This is what it looked like a week ago with all of the boxes in the living room. And then we had it staged up as a living room and then we took everything out and then we laid all the drop cloths and now we're gonna paint the ceiling. I'm excited, I'm nervous, I'm scared. I hope it looks cute. Let's get started. Okay, I got my paint suit on. Let's talk about the paint. I'm so excited to share with you guys that this video is in fact sponsored by Benjamin Moore, which is a full circle moment for me. If you guys watched my last moving out series, I painted pretty much the entire studio with Benjamin Moore cloud white paint. So I really love this paint and I cannot wait to showcase it for you guys. We have three different colors here. These two are for the ceiling. They are the waterborne ceiling paints and the sheen is ultra flat. Now the reason for that is because ceilings often 
often can be like a little bit bumpy. So an ultra flat sheen does a really good job at hiding the imperfections. So for the blue, I got mineral springs and for the white, I got Oxford white. Now, there are so many different colors to choose from. I had so many little paint chips. I was holding them up to the sky and I was just like, trying to find the perfect blue. And then I got one waterborne interior paint. Now I got this in the sheen eggshell in the color Veranda View, which is such a beautiful light green. And this is going to be covering this orange wall. I don't know if we're gonna get to this in this video, but it will for sure be in a future video. I literally am so excited about that. So I actually purchased these paints on Benjamin Moore's e-store. It's super easy and they actually have a really fun feature where you can try on the color colors in a room. It's very helpful if you're like me and a little bit indecisive with colors. But yeah, it's super simple. Once you have the color you like, you just place the order online and then the store will call you when it's ready for pickup and you can go get it. It's really easy and you don't have to sit in your car and wait for them to mix the paint because it's ready when you show up. But okay, let's get painting. I guess this is your debut. <laughs> Say hey. Hey! Clearly you've been here before based on your paint suit. <laughs> and I've painted before. This is gonna be fun. Mia, we always start out this is so gonna happy. Be fun. <laughs> oh, and <gasps> I'm just like looking at the sky that it's gonna be so nice. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. Whoa! Oh my goodness. So we're using a fluffy roller just to get in all the nooks on the roof. Wait, what am I doing? I cannot wait to use this, you guys. This is like a crazy extendo pole. Look how oh tall God. this is. Oh, wow. Whoa, my neck is gonna hurt. <laughs> yes. So let's see what the first swipe will look like against this yellow. Should I do right here? Sure. Oh my God, look how blue it is. Oh my gosh, it looks so blue up Oh. Oh my gosh! That is so pigmented. Right? Pigmented, it's like an eyeshadow. <laughs> oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Oh. <laughs> wow, it is only gonna need one coat. This is really, really thick. I'm so excited. Me too. Oh my. You know what you won't be excited for? <laughs> when you have to get up on the scaffold. Dude, wait, you're crawling up with all that stuff in your hands? Well, I'm gonna be afraid to reach Well, down. I can walk it up and hand you stuff afterwards. Oh, okay. Warning on the screen. Be careful on scaffolds. <sighs> you did that like nobody's business, girl. <laughs> I like that we're just one at a time up here, too. Yeah. The other one can call 911. Period. <laughs> Are you gonna be good up here? <laughs> okay, you can cut in first and then I'll cut in next. <laughs> You guys, the first step is painting the whole ceiling blue, and then it'll get a little more difficult because then we'll have to paint the clouds. You look funny up there. <laughs> You guys, when we were planning this video, my mom wanted me to buy those like 20 foot stilts. <laughs> and she was like, it's okay, I could figure it out. And like, that's a good way to die. All right, you guys, you're about to see what I see. Ooh, with the light coming in. Looks nice. Oh my God. It is so nice. Gonna go see mom. It's going great. It looks like, good. I do kind of forget I'm standing up here, so it's good to kind of like, you know, not get too Remember. comfortable and like take like all of a sudden walk <laughs> off the edge. Let's go <laughs> oh. 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 We're okay. Whoa. Just move them. If we can hold 
exhausting. And the other thing that I don't know if we did was put the brakes on. I put mine on. Did you put yours on? I don't think so. You did it. I was <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, why do you have to go over like that? Are you okay? <laughs> I'm doing a terrible job. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you guys, we just had lunch and we recruited another helper. Not the best help here, but <laughs> we're willing to try. So, good morning. Here you go. Now you're cutting in, which Sis. is very scary. Stop, stop. Okay, I want to see your work. Hey, remember when I fell off that one ladder? Is that Dad, good? No. You need more paint on your brush. It's hard on a slope. Oh, look at that. Almost good, it's just not close enough. I'm scared. How's this? That was good, yes. Okay, I think I'm on to it. Okay. Two seconds later. Are you serious? You are fired! <laughs> no helping us! Here, Dad. Wow. I don't know one part that can't get paint on it. Technically, that wasn't very good. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's happening? This is anarchy. <laughs> I just finished this highest part. It's gonna be smooth sailing now in the dining room area. Where is it? Right there. I just have to paint that. Everybody's still cutting in. It's looking good, but the high part's done. So super relieved about that because my neck is like literally broken. But it looks great. Like I'm loving it. Who else is loving it? I love it. <laughs> I love it. Good. And like seriously, it's only gonna need one coat. Usually when I paint, I always have to do two coats or three, but this is gonna be one coat and it's gonna cover, which is amazing. I'm freaking thankful too. Like, thank you Benjamin Moore for pulling up with one coat. Our 
All right, you guys, the blue ceiling is officially on. This has only been one coat and it's looking really good. We'll see in the morning how it looks with more natural light. But yeah, this literally took all day. So we're gonna get onto the clouds tomorrow. I cannot wait to see how they look. That's gonna be more the artistic part. This was more just like very hard on the neck. Oh my goodness, my neck. I'm exhausted. The roof is blue. Anyways, see you tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, you guys, it is day two. Today we are painting the clouds. This weird angle is because I wanna show you the sky and also myself, so hello. <laughs> it's a little bit high up. But the ceiling is looking great. I've been watching cloud videos all morning. I have like this concern that the clouds are gonna look like this. I just don't want them to look cartoonish. I want them to look realistic, but I also am realistic about my talent level. So we'll see. My mom and I have this little like board of wood that we're gonna try making a cloud on just as a test run. Are you ready for the competition? I am. Crisp white. Crisp He's like, let me add these sponges. <laughs> He's like, look at all these new toys. You'll do on this side, I'll do on this side, and then we'll reveal and see who is better. <laughs> okay. I'm so tired after yesterday. <laughs> it was way too interesting. <laughs> right? Why do you like these sponges so much, buddy? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's ugly. <laughs> Guys, here is my cloud. It looks like a mountain. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I say that we go to the shortest part of the ceiling and just try. Worst case scenario, we could just paint over it. Exactly. Okay, you guys, we're back up on the scaffold. This is the lowest part of the ceiling, so we're gonna try it here. <sighs> I'm nervous. I am too. I'm really scared. Well, there's only one way to try. Face your fears, babe. Yeah, you got to. <laughs> I feel so close to the ceiling. <laughs> oh, okay, though. Look at me, I'm resting my head. <laughs> we're gonna make them all really nice, and then we're gonna go and stand on the ground, and it's gonna be like, <laughs> hmm? Hmm? I think we're gonna have to go into a little bit with blue and just yeah. kind of add, and then just add some very crisp white. Okay. Oh, I love your cloud. Loving that cloud. <laughs> Wait, I'm blocking your cloud. <laughs> that looks great. It looks great. Oh my gosh. Is it? Look Michelangelo! <laughs> That's exactly what we were hoping for. All right, you guys, we turned one scaffold into two scaffolds. So now we're both able to reach the roof. It's coming out good. It's kind of scary up here, <laughs> but it's okay. Whoa, so scary. It is, isn't it? <laughs> Honestly, it's very scary. <laughs> Don't try this at home. Period. Period, you guys. This is real. Don't even. Mom, I got a question for you. What is it? Are these clouds worth dying for? <laughs> yes! Oh. The camera just fell off the scaffold. <laughs> Shh. 
Show it off, girl. It's my new invention. It's my cloud wand. I'm the fairy cloud mother. Oh. Oh, I broke. <laughs> Maybe I should just do it the old fashioned way. Go, girly. Go, girly. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. <laughs> your arm to save dad when the <laughs> scaffold was falling. Did I put my arm on? You were like... <laughs> it's falling! <laughs> we have to go up the big scaffold to paint the clouds up. <laughs> it's not, not fun. Okay, come on. <laughs> All right, you guys, we're up here painting. It's scary up here. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Mia, just sit straight and do not move. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just some time 
to relax because I didn't expect painting the ceiling to be such a stressful situation. Oh, it's folding! No, no, no I don't hold it. Okay, please. Don't push me. <laughs> oh. But everything aside, I am so happy with how it turned out. The paint was amazing. Thank you so much to Benjamin Amore again for sponsoring this video. I've had some time to stare at the clouds and I must admit, I do have a favorite, let me show you. Here is my favorite cloud. It's also the first cloud I did. I also really like this one. Here's a cloud that looks like a splat. This one looks like an iguana. This one kind of looks like Chip. And this one looks like a UFO. But it's been really fun seeing the clouds that we painted actually look like shapes, just like the real clouds in the sky do. The dining area is my favorite full area. I just think all these clouds look the most realistic. So you guys can probably tell there's a difference between the vibe of the house down here and the sky we just painted. This is just a little taste of what we're gonna do in here. It's gonna be a color explosion, a fun explosion, like you're stepping into a storybook and this is just the beginning. Before I forget, let's do the charity portion. Okay, so today's charity that you guys have chosen is the Boston Children's Hospital. I was over on their website and it says Boston Children's Hospital has been named the country's number one pediatric hospital by U.S. News and World Report eight years in the running. This is a testament to our fierce commitment to families and the trust they place to, in us to deliver care when it matters most. So it sounds like a really good place to put today's donation towards. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have a favorite cloud, comment down below which one it is and what does it look like. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!